In this press release from Lieutenant Steve Doors with the Baytown Police Department, on Friday, May 31st at 1149 p.m., Baytown Police were dispatched to 4219 West Baker in reference to a disturbance involving a gun. On arrival, officers contacted three subjects who reported they were arguing over rent money. Officers attempted to detain Jayton Laborde, as it was unknown who had a weapon. Jayton resisted by pulling and pushing the officer away. Daylin Santillian attempted to interfere by trying to keep officers from taking Laborde into custody. Santillian would not comply with orders to stay away and pulled away from officers when they attempted to take her into custody. The Harris County District Attorney's Office was contacted. Laborde was charged with resisting arrest and Santillian was arrested for interference with public duties. Davier Guide was the third subject contacted and he was arrested for Baytown traffic warrants. All three subjects denied that there was a gun involved. Six feet, the unit's coming over here to go ahead and hang out out of sight in the back or on the side. We'll advise as soon as we're ready to make a plan. Just a status update. We're, 9 8 is what the price on the phone with the crisis hotline right now. That's what we're waiting on. Hey, the units that are already behind the way is that gate open where we can get back there from uh, Baker? One of the units out here. Uh, the back door is already unlocked, so if you want to make your way to the back door, just don't be seen once you go in. Hello from Lieutenant Steve Doris with the Baytown Police Department. On Saturday, June 1st at 811 p.m., officers responded to a welfare concern at the subway located in the 4100 block of Decker Drive. Upon arrival, officers contacted EMS personnel who advised they had been dispatched in reference to a 28-year-old female who called claiming she needed help. However, when EMS personnel offered their help to the female, she became uncorporative and would not allow EMS to assist her. And it became apparent to EMS personnel that the female was experiencing a mental episode. Officers and EMS attempted to talk with the female to try to help her. However, she continued to refuse their help which was exacerbated by the fact she was holding a small child. And EMS and police were familiar with her from previous encounters involving her mental state. After several hours of negotiation with the female, officers were ultimately able to detain her and have her transported to the Harris County Center for Mental Health and Neuropsychiatric Center, where she was committed under an emergency detention order. You're going to go through the back. We don't want anyone coming through the front. 62 units in the back of subway. Anyone find the unlocked door? 121 stating it should be unlocked. 